Hi there, Mark Kaufman, Certified Sommelier. Sometimes I call this the one minute wino because you can learn more about wine in a minute than you ever thought you could. I wanna talk a little bit about Chardonnay, everybody's go-to white wine. Whenever we don't have the inspiration of the moment, we're sitting around, the choice is, okay, I'll have a glass of Chardonnay. But you know, Chardonnay can be very special. It is the great white burgundy grape of France. And when it's transported over to Napa Valley, it can take on overtones of anything from fresh fruity apples to rich, creamy, oaky, and buttery characteristics. Very interesting grape variety, Chardonnay. I stumbled on one, literally, just a couple of days ago that I thought is really something special because it's an older Chardonnay. You can't find old vintage Chardonnays from California because normally they don't hold up, okay? So I was really surprised when I discovered this. Oh, let me pull the cork out of this. Ah, my favorite sound. This is True Blood Chardonnay from uh, Carneros region, which is the south end of Napa Valley where really good Chardonnays are made. And I found one from uh, 2011 vintage and one from the 2012 vintage. And as I say, it's really rare that we get these aged Chardonnays. So we're gonna take a little taste here. Both wines appear to be real sound. They have that kind of a green gold color, which is, which is what you expect in a Chardonnay that's got a little bit of age on it. So I'm gonna start ooh, with just uh, some aromas, and they, there really is a noticeable difference between the two. Very interesting. 2011 has much more of that hay, straw, a little bit of, of uh, butter note to it. The, uh, the 2012 has much more uh, oak evident. I think one of them had much more of what we call malolactic fermentation than the other, um, which softens the wine a little bit. So the 2011... Mm. Mm. has a lot of flavor in the mouth. The acid is still evident. It's tailing off a little bit though, but this wine with a rich cream sauce kind of fish dish mm, would be just yummy. Now for the 2012. Mm. Very different fruit. The, um, the fruit style is more emphasized in the 2012. The acidity is a little brighter. I could definitely see this with uh, Dungeness Crab, something like that. So uh, I would take a look for True Blood. You probably have to find it on the internet because uh, um, I don't see it around in too many stores. Uh, True Blood Carneros Napa Valley Chardonnay 2011 and 2012. There's probably only very little available because I'm sure uh, it's probably from their wine library. So that's the story on Chardonnay for today from the One Minute Wine Hall.